amazing people. Oliver here from Copenhagen, Denmark. I felt inspired to make another video. Just wanted to share with you guys something I've learned in my life that's really made a big difference. And you know, there's so many things you can relate between sports and business. You know, and being an athlete has actually taught me so much that I still apply today in my businesses. And you know, the fundamental principles in being a professional athlete carry over to business. You know, the persistence, the ability to fail over and over and over again to have that moment of success, you know. And one of the things I learned in my tennis career when I was in college was, you know, focus on your strengths. Um, my forehand was stronger than my backhand in my game in tennis. And the coach said, you know, you can spend a lot of time working on a weakness to try and make it into a strength, but most likely it will become average. So the weakness might become something that, yes, you work on it, it gets a bit stronger. But if you've already got a strength and you work hard on a strength, it can become a weapon. And that's what I did. You know, I really, really worked hard on my game, on my forehand, on my strength. And, you know, and that ended up becoming something that was somewhat of a weapon and it helped me to win a lot more matches and in business you need to do the same thing you need to say to yourself what are my weaknesses and what are my strengths and in my opinion i think it's better to focus on those strengths and develop those strengths into weapons as opposed to spending your time on weaknesses which might or might not become strengths and you might just be average with those in the end instead of being you know excellent in a certain department and all the most successful people I know, they focus on one thing and they give it all their energy and all their time and they end up becoming great at that. You know, Malcolm Gladwell said in Outliers, you know, if you spend 10,000 hours focusing on a specific trade, you'll become an expert in your field, you know. And if you spend more time than that, then you can start to reach the 1%, the 0.5%, the 0.1% in your field. And that's when you are adding so much more value um, than anyone else and as I've made a video in the past guys the amount of income you earn the amount of value is in direct proportion to the amount of value you can go out there and add you know so ask yourself what are my strengths what are my weaknesses focus on developing or even spending more time on those strengths and you know I think you'll get some incredible incredible results hope that video helps have an awesome awesome day